I am so excited about today's video. I am finally showing you guys an official apartment tour. The sad thing is that I move out in less than a week. <laughs> but it took me forever to finally get myself to do this video for you guys because first of all, I'm a perfectionist and I never really felt like my apartment was fully decorated. Now here we are um, less than a week before I move out. Finally doing this video for you guys because I kept putting it off because once I film this, I will actually have to start packing and I don't want to do that. <laughs> so yeah, this is a one bedroom, one bathroom apartment. It was the perfect amount of space for me. It was about 600 square feet if I remember correctly. So I'm going to give you guys an overview of the apartment first and then show you guys each room and where everything is from and chat about it with you guys. So we're just going to jump right in. I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And yeah, here is the official apartment tour. Girl, it's been too long. Clock done fell off the wall. Been out here writing songs. Where the hell did the time go? Take on my passions with pain. But would you do the same? I'm going so insane. Thinking about where you and I go. Freak, it seems like forever when you sit and think about it. I put my heart out on my sleeve, but I can't live with Okay, so here is my little entryway. Obviously, this is a front door. Um, so over here, I just have a little hook thing that I can put all my purses on my keys and everything just to keep everything in one spot this is from tj maxx or home goods i believe and then i don't know if you guys can see here i'll include a separate clip but i have a floor mat where i keep all my shoes so yeah entryway and then moving on to the kitchen this is my kitchen and i'm so so obsessed with it i love this giant island this kind of replaces a kitchen table in my apartment since i don't really have room for one so i have stools on the other side my chairs are from amazon they're linked on my amazon storefront if you guys are interested in checking these exact ones out i love the color of them they're like this beautiful cream color but not too yellowy which i'm not a huge fan of like yellowy cream color schemes you know what i'm saying and then here we have a trash can of course over here is my pantry i guess you could call it it's not technically a pantry but this is where i keep all of my food i have this wire rack that i got from target and i also keep just a couple of random things in here this is where i keep my ladder vacuum broom all that stuff and then this is where the water heater is there's also a shelf up here which that's where i keep my paper towels which i'm out of right now and then just a couple of random things so nothing super interesting in there so we have these beautiful white cabinets so up here i keep a lot of like random plastic bags and old trader joe's bags because you never know when you might need one and then here is my refrigerator and freezer one of the things that i was like weirdly excited about for living in my own apartment was having my own refrigerator and freezer since i've always lived with room I've always had to share the refrigerator and freezer space and I just love stocking up on Trader Joe's frozen meals <laughs> So having my own freezer to just you know put anything in was just really exciting for me for some reason I don't know over here next to the refrigerator I have my little coffee station or I guess half of my coffee station the other half is over there this is my baby my Nespresso I love this thing so much I use it all the time it's truly life-changing my parents got it for me for a Christmas present last year and I just love it so much and then over here we have the rest of my little coffee station and I have these cute little espresso cups my parents also got those for me for Christmas last year and then I have this cute little tray with coffee stuff on it my grandma got that for me and then above that I have the microwave here however I have all of my mugs and I just have a bunch of like random drink related things so like reusable water bottles I have like chai tea here espresso pods and then down here we have a couple drawers and cabinets so this is where I keep 
keep all of my seasonings and some K-cups. Here I have a drawer full of stuff. <laughs> this is where I keep my aluminum foil and my parchment paper. Down here, I'm warning you, it's kind of a mess. <laughs> I have all my pots and pans and glassware, all that stuff. Down here I have my cutting boards and my baking trays. Over here I have this cute little sign that says La Tida on it. That's from Hobby Lobby. And then I have my paper towel holder. The paper towel holder is from Home Goods. So then moving on to the oven area. I have this hood above the oven which is so cool. I have never had one of those. I love the look of it. On my stove I always have this out. This is the always pan. I use this all the time. I absolutely love it. And my parents also got this for me for Christmas this past year. And then I always keep a couple towels on the oven door. I just think it's really cute. And then moving on to this area. Up there I have a very, very dead plant. Okay, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. That plant died quite a while ago. But I just could not get myself to throw it away. And if you don't look too closely, it really doesn't look that dead. <laughs> Here I have my main cabinet with all of my plates and glassware and everything. Over here we have two very essential things. <laughs> we have the Keurig, which I know it's kind of excessive to have both a Keurig and an espresso, but I love K-Cups, can't part with those, so I have to have a Keurig for that, and then the Nespresso is obviously great for espresso drinks. And then we have this beautiful aesthetic toaster, I love this. A company also sent me this, this is from Bydeem. And then lastly for this whole section, I have all of my silverware and utensils in this drawer, it's kind of chaotic. I also want to just give a little shout out to my beautiful gold silverware. I bought this when I moved into this apartment and let me just say I am definitely happy with my purchase it's so unnecessary but it makes me so happy and I use this stuff every day so why not just invest a little more in the silverware because it really does bring me a lot of happiness <laughs> oh and then these organizers are all from Target these were also really inexpensive and then down here it's also kind of a mess this is where I keep all of my Tupperware um yeah it's kind of chaotic down here as well okay next up is this side of my kitchen. Here I have a bunch of drawers which I'm not going to get into what's in all of these because it's a lot of junk. Um, there's absolutely nothing in here that's organized so there's just no need. <laughs> Anyways, this is where I have my sink of course and then I also have uh, cabinets here. I don't know. I think you guys can see that. Um, this is just where I keep all my cleaning stuff. And then, of course, the dishwasher. And then, lastly, for my little kitchen area, I have this beautiful mirror in the middle of this wall. I love this mirror. This is actually from the kids section of Home Goods. It's obviously just like plasticky, but it works, it's cute, and I like it, so. Oh, and it was pretty inexpensive. I think it was like $30, $35, which is a steal, so we love that. <laughs> like you guys saw in the overview of my apartment, my apartment has a very open concept. It flows very nicely. There aren't any random walls just blocking anything, which I absolutely love. So, as you guys can see, we're in the kitchen, and I'm gonna turn around. And we're in the living room. <laughs> Here is my living room. Hi, you can see me in the mirror. I love my living room so much. So we're gonna start over here. I have this basket. This is a nice little blanket basket. I got this also from Home Goods. Welcome to my couch. <laughs> I have to be honest with you guys, I hate this couch, but I do have to give credit where credit is due. It's a very comfortable couch. I just hate the fabric. I don't know what it is. It just like gives me the chills like touching the couch. It's really weird and it was totally my fault because I did buy this couch brand new. It's from Bob's Furniture. Yeah, I just, I don't know. There's just something about the couch. And then these pillows came with the couch but I got pillow covers off of Amazon. These are also linked on my storefront if you guys want to go and check them out. And then I also have this cute pillow. Doug got this for me so I don't know where it's from but it's cute. <laughs> okay, so above the couch, I have this cute little artwork piece. So Doug actually got this for me, so I don't know where it's from either. 
But yeah, it just kind of fills up the wall really nice. Believe it or not, my dad actually made this table for me. He literally made it. He made it, <laughs> which was just so nice of him. But it is just a beautiful table. It's exactly what I wanted. I love the color of it, and I also love this pattern that goes down the middle. But yeah, it truly is just a beautiful table, and I'm so thankful that he made this for me. And that was just so cool of him. So shout out to you, Dad. Thank you. <laughs> and the cool thing here, I'll show you guys. You guys have to see this. It even opens up. It's a table that opens up for more storage, which I think is just so cool. Okay, so moving on to this. I got I got this from Home Goods. I love like the boho vibe of it. And I just wanted something on my table that I could put stuff in, and this was perfect. So I just have my remotes in there and this cute little bowl with a couple crystals in there. I got this bowl from a local boutique along with the crystals. And then I also have this candle. I actually made this candle at a local candle making boutique. So yeah, I like keeping that there. And then I also got these beautiful dried flowers and the clear glass vase from a local boutique, the same one that I got this cute little bowl from. And then of course I just have a Pioneer Woman magazine on the bottom because what else would be there? And then these coasters are really cute. They're from Target. And of course we can't forget about the rug. I have loved this rug so, so much and I just adore it. I think it's so pretty. This is from Wayfair. I do wish I would have gotten a bigger rug because this is all laminate I think laminate wood floors I don't know laminate something I think that's what it's called but I can't be for sure but yeah I do love this rug I think it's so cute and then over here in this corner we have this huge mirror I am such a mirror person I love this mirror so much you know it's great for all the mirror picks outfit checks outfit of the days this is from Amazon I'm pretty sure it's already linked on my Amazon storefront I'll double check for you guys and then next to the mirror I have this cute little plant and of course a cute little plant stand these are both from Flowerland I think and then I have this cute hanging sign that says welcome Welcome to the garden that's from the target dollar section this plant is doing pretty good it looks a little sparse but these are all new leaves that are coming in and then we can't forget about these plants on the windowsill of course i love this pink plant so much we'll just have to take a moment for the plants and then next to my window i have this cute little wooden thing plant holder and my dad actually made this for me too and he attached these to this like rustic wooden plank I don't know if you guys could ever tell, but this plant and that one are both fake. I feel like it's pretty obvious. This one is very much real. This is also from Target and same with this. But that kind of concludes this little area. Don't mind the tripod. This is a door to the heater <laughs> moving on to this part of my living room okay so up here i have this giant letter board i'm so obsessed with this my dad actually also made me the ledges and of course he stained it with the same stain from my coffee table we love the matchy matchy vibes <laughs> so i got the giant letters from amazon and then down here of course we have my tv this is from sam's club in case you were wondering i I want to say it's a 50 inch, but I cannot be sure about that. And then I also have this TV stand. I just wanted something very basic. It's from Target. We love it. <laughs> and then as for all of this stuff, I have a yoga mat. I also have this super cute candle and candle stand, but it's from a local boutique. This is a disco ball that I never managed to hang up. <laughs> I will hang it up in my room or my next apartment, whatever that is, and it will do all of its amazing disco ball magic <laughs> but my sister got that for me and I think she got it off of Amazon over here I just have a couple cute little random decorations this was a gift from Doug and then these are just cute little vases from Target and then I just have my beats pill back there down here I just have a basket that holds all of my random cords and such I have my Wi-Fi thing modem I think is what it's called I don't know 
know. And then I have my printer over here. This is a iPad stand that my sister got for me. And then that's something I don't know what it is. <laughs> so yeah, that is everything in my living room. So we're gonna move into my bedroom now. Okay, so this is my little desk area. I think this turned out so cute, like decoration wise. So up here I have three cute little wall art things. I got the art from Etsy and then I think I got them printed through Staples, I wanna say, online. And then I also have a lamp over there. That's from Amazon. Over here we have my actual desk, of course. So the desk itself is from Target. And then I just have so much stuff on my desk. It's kind of annoying, especially like if you look all the stuff in my desk, oh, it's too much. <laughs> this is from Target and you can just change the date, you can change the month, all the fun stuff. And then I have a perfume out. I have all of my little utensils, my writing utensils and markers and pens and everything in this pencil holder. I think this is also from Target, but probably from the dollar section, so nothing too special. And then I have this cute little picture frame of my boyfriend and I with all these fun little stickers. And then I have this cute little geode that Doug got me a while ago and another one of those Target coasters. And then here I just keep my laptop and a little desk calendar. And then this is my iPad and my notebook. And we're definitely not gonna go through everything in my desk. <laughs> and then next to my desk, I have a little trash can. So yeah, that's my entire desk area. Okay, so as you can see, we have a window, which I didn't talk about my view. My view is really nice. I actually really love it, especially in the spring and summer. Like, come on, this is beautiful. Okay, so this is just clutter. Over here, I have my arts and crafts station. <laughs> this is a cart full of all of my Cricut stuff, and then, of course, my Cricut on top. I have this cute little plant this planters from Target um, It makes it look organized on the outside, but it's really not very organized on the inside So we don't need to look at that. Okay, so here's my bed. Um, I Don't have like a normal bed frame. It's just the bottom part um, I bought this a few years ago when I moved into my sorority house and I'm pretty sure it was just from Amazon But I got it for a really good deal on Prime Day. I want to say that's why I got this one. There's so much stuff underneath, but we don't need to look at that. Okay, so my comforter is actually a duvet cover. That's also from Amazon. I love the sage color. I think it's so cute. And then I have this pink blanket on top. My mom gave this to me a very long time ago, so I don't know where it's from. But then I have a couple of cute little pillows. This one's from Home Goods, and this one's from Target. And then these pillowcases came in a different comforter set. I think it's from OCM. And then I have these cute little fairy lights. These are also from Amazon. I think they're really cute. The camera's kind of being a little weird. Can't focus on them. That's okay. Okay, over here I have my nightstand. So I only have one. I bought this off of someone at GV that I went to school with. And then this is just my phone charger that I have here. And this is a basket of a lot of random stuff. I have some clips. Advil, <laughs> my computer charger, some stuff for my camera, a random but very cute candle. But yeah, this is kind of a mess. And then I have my giant squishmallow right there, of course. And now we have this corner of my room. I honestly really love this corner and I'm kind of sad that I only had this decorated for about a week so far. And my intention with this wall was to do a mirror collage wall. So I was gonna have all gold mirrors, just like a bunch of different shapes and sizes and it just didn't work out unfortunately <laughs> and then one of my friends Elena got me this beautiful piece of wall art which if you know you know it's Taylor Swift related <laughs> this one's from Hobby Lobby this one's from a local boutique and then this one's from Urban Outfitters okay so moving on from my room into my closet that's one of the unique things about this apartment the closet is just right here and then that's the bathroom which I actually really liked it for one person so here we have the washer and dryer such a plus for this apartment oh my goodness you guys and then here we just have a little rack so I have a bunch of random stuff I have my iron my laundry detergent my dryer sheets some extra purses and just some random stuff and then I have all my coats here this is my hamper and then more random stuff which we're not gonna get into that <laughs> and then on this side I have my entire closet all of my clothes again this is a mess 
mess so sorry about it I have a bunch of clutter up there but I also brought this shelf so this is just a regular cube organizer from Target this is where I keep all of my folded stuff you guys can kind of see and then in the bins I have like socks and underwear and everything but I just thought this was a really good way of organizing it without having to buy like an actual dresser and there really wasn't much space for a real dresser either so and then I have some boxes because of course I'm getting ready to move and I don't have any storage to put boxes in so the boxes are just chilling right there and then lastly here I have my shoe organizer the actual organizer is from Target but this was really helpful clearly I have too many pairs of shoes so yeah this is my entire closet it's very spacious we love that and then moving on into the bathroom welcome to my bathroom nothing too crazy you know it has a sink really cute countertops it's like a faux marble sort of situation I do my makeup in here so I have all my makeup products skincare stuff we have three drawers and then some cabinet space this is all a disaster I will not show you guys so yeah we have a towel holder right there um what else I have these cute shelves I'm obsessed with these shelves I love them so much they're floating shelves I saw them on TikTok and I ran straight to Amazon to buy them um I think they were like $35 which is so cheap for these but yeah I made Doug install these they're so cute and oh I just love them okay so right here I have some skincare stuff and then I have these cute little jars and up here I have the cutest wall art I think that is so funny for some reason and it's perfect for a bathroom I got it off of Etsy and got it printed from Staples and then I have a candle from Dossier and a cute little fragrance thing that my grandma got me over here I have the trash can that's from Target this scale is from Amazon this is a shelf for the shower from Ikea that broke that's just gonna chill right there <laughs> these are a set of bath bombs from Lush and then here we have my shower nothing interesting at all in my shower but the shower curtain itself is from OCM and then over here I have more towels and my robe and then these floor mats are of course matching these are from Target I really wanted to get white ones because clearly we have a white aesthetic going on in here but I thought they would get dirty really fast so we went with the lighter beige color instead I really like them so yeah that's my entire bathroom nothing crazy or too special I didn't go Go crazy with like decorating in here at all so that's it for my apartment tour I hope you guys enjoyed it I loved this place so much and I'm honestly so sad I'm gonna be leaving I am gonna be vlogging the moving out process which is not as fun as moving in of course I did vlog moving into this apartment if you guys want to go see that I'll link the playlist right here for you guys but if you guys do want to see me moving out I will definitely be posting those videos soon so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss those but yeah thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed but yeah thank you guys so so much for watching i love you guys so much and i will see you guys very soon bye